Hey everybody, it's I Want to Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at running MX Linux in Proxmox. To get started, navigate to mxlinux.org and download the latest installation ISO. With the installation ISO in hand, navigate to the Proxmox web UI and get logged in. Expand the Proxmox node name, then select the target storage device where we're going to upload the ISO. Select ISO images, then click Upload and select File. Browse to and select the MX Linux installation ISO, then click Upload. Once the installation ISO is uploaded to the Proxmox host, we're ready to start creating the VM. Right click on the Proxmox node name and select Create VM. Give the VM a unique ID and name, then click Next. Select the storage device with the MX Linux ISO, then select it and click Next. Leave the defaults on the System tab, then click Next. Set the storage device for the virtual disk and set the disk size to at least 30 GB, then click Next. Set the number of CPU cores to two or more and set the CPU type to Host, then click Next. Set the memory to 4096 or 4 GB, then click Next. Leave the defaults on the Network tab then click Next, and click Finish to create the VM. Select the VM from the left navigation menu, then click the Start button at the top right of the screen. And finally, click Console so we can see the visual output. Press Enter to continue booting MX Linux. Once the desktop environment loads, click Install MX Linux on the Welcome dialog. Press Escape to cancel the disk check, then click Yes to continue. Adjust the keyboard layout, then click Next. Click Next, and then Yes to confirm formatting the disk. Enter a computer name, and optionally a domain name and workgroup, then click Next. Enter a username and password, then click Next. Wait while MX Linux copies and installs files. Once the installation completes, click Finish, and the VM will reboot. When prompted to remove the installation media, navigate back to the Proxmox web UI and select Hardware, then double click the CD DVD drive and select Do Not Use Any Media and click OK. Optionally, select Options and double click QMU Guest Agent, then check the box to enable it and click OK. With the settings changed, start the VM and go back to the console. Once you reach a login screen, Log in using the username and password you set up during the installation. Close the welcome dialog, then launch a terminal from the applications menu. Run sudo apt update to update the software repositories, followed by sudo apt install qmu guest agent. A subsequent reboot is required to start the guest agent. Welcome to MX Linux, running as a Proxmox VM.